objective 3 find the probability by using Poisson distribution so this is our notation as distribute Poisson lambda so we can find by using formula so the formula is probability x equal to small x equal to exponent to the power of negative lambda times lambda to the power of x divided by x factorial to use formula make sure the notation is equal we can also find the probability by using Poisson table Poisson table it use cumulative distribution same as binomial distribution concept so make sure the notation is x greater equal than small x so we can use table example 2 if x distribute Poisson with lambda 3.5 by using formula find this probability is x equal to 5 so the formula is exponent to the power of negative lambda multiplied with lambda to the power of x divided by x factorial and then we calculate the answer is 0 0.1322 for the question b x less than 2 is the probability x less equal than 1 so if we want to use formula we must write into equal notation so x less equal than 1 is equal to probability x equal to 0 plus probability x equal to 1 so when we have equal notation then we can use formula for x equal to 0 the formula exponent power of negative lambda multiply with lambda power of x divided by x factorial and then for x equal to 1 and plus for probability x equal to 1 formula is exponent power of negative lambda multiply with lambda to the power of x divided by x factorial calculate this value so we get 0 0.0302 plus 0 0.1057 and the final answer is 0 0.1359 for the question c probability is greater or equal than 2 so if you want to calculate it impossible because we do not have n so what we do is we know that we know that probability for all value of x is 1 then we have to minus with the x that we exclude that is 0 and 1 mean that 1 minus probability is less equal than 1 so x less equal than 1 uh, we can take the answer from question b that is 0 0.1359 we substitute this value into question c and we get 1 minus 0 0.1359 so the final answer is 0 0.8641 Example 3 If x is Poisson distribute with lambda 19 by using Poisson table find this probability For the question A is probability x equal to 0 by using table It's same as binomial concept So we have to find probability x greater or equal than 10 and then we minus with the next x that is probability x greater equal than 11 then we can get only 10 so we find the value in table by referring to the lambda 19 and the 10 is r okay. this is the table of Poisson probability we have lambda here and we have the value of r or value of x at both sides so you can uh, refer at the both side so the the number of lambda is start from 0 0.1 until 30 okay if you look at the uh, page uh, the Poisson distribution table start page 12 and until 
page page 18 eh, where is the lambda the highest lambda lambda equal to 30 and the value of r until to 54 okay so for the question uh, 3 for example 3 we have lambda 19 so you have to find uh, for the lambda so go to your table until you found 19 so this is lambda equal to 19 so you want to find the value of x is 10 10 and 11 so this is the value of 10 and 11 0 0.9911 and 0 0.981 so we get the the probability is 0 0.9911 and and minus with 0 0.9817 so the answer is 0 0.0094 for question B okay we have probability 13 until 17 include so we can separate this probability into x greater or equal than 13 and then we have to minus with x greater or equal than 18 so find this probability in Poisson table for this uh, question B we want to find for lambda lambda 19 and x is 13 and then we minus with x 18 so for value of 13 is this one and for 18 this so we take these two value and put into our work so we get that answer minus with the probability for x greater or equal than 18 and the final answer is 0 0.3178 for the question c probability 20 until 28 exclude or we can say it probability between 20 and 28 so the both no, the both sign is do not have equal to find this probability we will take probability as greater or equal than 21 because 20 is exclude so we don't do not have to take 20 so we start from 21 until infinity that means it include 28 until infinity so that's why we have to minus with probability as greater or equal than 28 because 28 until infinity is exclude so here we we can get from 21 until 27 so we use Poisson table to find the probability so we get 0.3528 minus with 0.0313 so the final answer is 0.3215 Example 4, the number of telephone call made to a customer service can be modeled by Poisson distribution with a mean of 3 calls per 5 minutes. Find the probability that okay, A, B and C. So the, the keyword here is mean of 3 calls and 5 minutes. So we can uh, write the notation of Poisson distribution as X is distributed Poisson with lambda is 3. Question A, no call is made in 5 minutes. So the probability we can write as Px equal to 0. Mean that no call are made. So want to find in 5 minutes. So we can use this lambda equal to 3. For the question B, at least 3 call are made in 5 minutes. At least 3. So that's mean probability x greater or equal than 3 remember at least it's same as meaning of minimum so we want to find the probability in 5 minutes so we can use lambda equal to 3 for the question c between 12 and 20 calls are made in half an hour so this is a very important information here uh, half an hour means that 30 minutes and between 12 and 20 means that we can write into the uh, probability 12 until 20 exclude.
Okay, for the solution, x is Poisson distribute with lambda 3 for every 5 minutes. For the question A, we use lambda 3 since the question want us to find in 5 minutes. So x equal to 0, we can use formula or we can use Poisson table. So if you want to use Poisson table, so it becomes probability at greater or equal than 0 minus with probability at greater or equal than 1. So we only get 0. So x greater or equal than 0 is 1 minus with 0 0.95, 0 2 for the probability x greater or equal than 1. So the final answer is 0 0.04. Nine, eight. For the question B, so x greater or equal than three. So because the question asks at least three call, so at least the notation is greater or equal. So since the notation is already in greater or equal, so we can directly use Poisson table. Find in the table with lambda three, and we get the answer is zero point five seven. 6, 8. For the question C, for the question C, the time given is half an hour. So half an hour is 30 minutes. So we have to find the new lambda. So if 5 minutes, the lambda is 3, then for 30 minutes, means that we have to multiply lambda with 6. So we get the new lambda is 18. So we, we have new lambda here for 30 minutes. So the question is find probability between 12 and 20. So we have, so we can write as probability 13 until 19 include. So we know we want to find x 13 until 19. Means that we have to find probability x greater equal than 13. We have to start x with 13 minus with x greater or equal than 20. Okay, since 19 must include in our probability. So we find in so we get the probability in the table. So we get 0 0.9083 minus with 0 0.3491. So the final answer is 0 0.5592. Example 5. The number of industrial injuries per working week in a particular factory is known to follow a Poisson distribution with mean 0 0.5. Find the probability that this question. So the keyword here is per week and the mean is 0 0.5. In the question, A, in a particular week, there will be less than 2 accidents. So here, the duration is one week for the probability less than two accidents. So we can write into the probability as less than two without equal notation. Question B, in two weeks, there will be more than three accidents. So the keywords here is two weeks. In the question, it just give one week. So the question for two weeks, we have to get new lambda and the probability we want to find is more than 3 accident. So x greater than 3 without equal notation. For the question C, there will be no accident in 3 weeks period. So the word no accident and the information at 3 weeks period means that we have to find probability x equal to 0 and for 3 weeks period, we have to find the new lambda. For the solution, A, the lambda is 0 0.5 for one week. So we want to find probability as less than 2. The, the notation is less than. If we look the, the value of x, we get 0 until infinity. So we want x less than 2. So we need 0 and 1. For 2, 3 and above, we have to exclude. So that's mean 1 minus probability x greater or equal than 2. 
so 1 minus 0 0.0902 so the final answer is 0 0.9098 okay, for the question B we have two weeks so the new lambda is 1 if one week is 0 0.5 so two weeks the lambda is 1 so by referring to the new lambda we find the probability as greater than 3 so we write into the greater equal notation we get probability as greater equal than 4 so we find the value in the table we get direct answer here 0 0.0190 for the question C for the question C we we have to find the new lambda since it has for 3 weeks so new lambda is 1.5 so the question is probability of no accident means that x equal to 0 so you can use formula or you can use table minus with probability x greater equal than 1 so we get the probability by using table then we have 1 minus 0 0.7769 and the answer is 0 0.2231